بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على شرف الأنبياء والمرسلين سيدنا مصطفى وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين وبعد أحبة في الله all praises due to Allah سبحانه وتعالى complete peace and blessings be bestowed upon our noble prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم أحبة في الله we've been looking at the prayers that the prophet recited to Allah سبحانه وتعالى This is today we're coming in the prayer that Nabina Adam alayhi salatu wa salam recited to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. After a couple of times, Sayyiduna Adam alayhi salatu wa salam recited to Allah jala wala Bada'udhu billahi sami'a alim mina shaitan nurayim. Qawana rabbana dhulamna anfusana وَإِن لَّمْ تَغْفِرْ لَنَا وَتَرْحَمْنَا لَنَكُونَنَّ مِنَ الْخَاسِرِينَ Then Sayyidina Adam alayhi salatu wa salam replied Our Lord we have wronged ourselves If you do forgive us and give mercy on us we will certainly be rulers Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is often the one forgiving and in case someone comes across any burden And someone comes across any wrong that he has done against Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah commences this in Surah Al-A'raf verse 23. According to the information of the Quran itself, this prayer was uttered by Sayyidina Adam alayhi salatu salam. And Eve, who is famously known as Hawa, after being expelled from heaven and expelled into the world by asking forgiveness for their sins with this prayer. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also He is the one who granted them the, 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 the permission or the pardon of their forgiveness. Sayyiduna Adam alayhi salatu wa salam was given pardon by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Great scholars, the Prophet alayhi salatu wa salam also advises the believers to be sticking together to tie the hold on these prayers as well as they are supplicating to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Rabbana. قال ربنا ظلمنا انفسنا وان لم تغفر لنا وترحمنا ولا كننا من الخاسرين الله سبحانه وتعالى should not let us at least if he doesn't forgive us automatically we can be great losers but if you stick to this this prayer was pardoned to sayyidina adam alayhi salatu wassalam inshallah ta'ala khibati fi allah let's also join into hands let's also practice the dua of sayyidina adam alayhi salatu wassalam so that we learn the duas We learn the du'as of Sayyidina Mustafa alayhi salatu wasalam as we come next inshallah ta'ala we shall be looking at the du'a of Sayyidina uh, 